Hello. Um, actually, you, I don't know if you have seen Arita and me. This is Patty Boule. I am the vlogging grandmother, but as you all know, I'm a singer, okay? I, I have been traveling the UK with my show, Arita and me. It's actually based on the music of Rita Franklin. I did do a show like this. I write the script myself. I did a show like this for um, Billy. It's called Billy and Me, Billy Holiday. And it was a music of Billy Holiday. And then what I do is draw comparisons between my life and Billy Holiday. And I bring in aspects of my life, you know, the African side, the Europe, you know, whatever I've learned in Britain, the British side. And I bring all of that into quite a humorous show. Entertaining, I hope. If you can imagine being humorous about Billie Holiday, well, I managed to do it, it seemed. After that, I just thought, well, I'd have a go at doing Aretha Franklin. And as I started writing the show, dear Aretha Franklin passed away, may her soul rest in peace. So I continued because I thought it'd be a good tribute to her. And do you know what I did? I I put on Facebook, you know, because wow, I mean, she really was the greatest singer, seriously, female singer. She recorded over 300 songs. Come on! It's like she never took time off. Anyway, so I thought, how do I choose? I needed 17 songs altogether. How do I choose? I thought, go to your Facebook friends, ask them to suggest their favorite Aretha Franklin songs, okay? How difficult could that be? <laughs> so Patty put this on Facebook. Ness and Dorma kept turning up. I didn't know she sang Ness and Dorma. Come on, who thinks that Aretha Franklin sang Ness and Dorma? So I thought, Ness and Dorma, is this a joke? What part of Aretha Franklin is Pavarotti? I mean, come on people. So I decided to Google it. Yikes. She did sing Ness and Dorma. I thought, I'm so dead. Because it seemed like it's everybody's favorite Aretha Franklin. What happened to R-E-S-P-E-C-T? You know, Ness and Dorma. I thought, oh dear, I've got to do Ness and Dorma. So I decided to, to learn Ness and Dorma. You know, the shame of it is I was so busy learning. I don't speak Italian, so obviously <laughs> I had to learn quickly. My grandson, he was about five at the time, developed an Italian accent listening to me <laughs> trying to practice this. It's so funny. But the funny thing is he was better than his grandmother on this. Okay, so I had to learn to sing Ness and Dorma. And I'm about to play it to you. If you don't like the way I sing it, for goodness sakes, well, please don't leave any nasty comments. Just admire my audacity, will you? Here is Ness and Dorma. Thank you. 